Special districts also known as special service districts, special district governments, limited purpose entities, or special purpose districts in the United States are independent, special purpose governmental units that exist separately from local governments such as county, municipal, and township governments, with substantial administrative and fiscal independence. They are formed to perform a single function or a set of related functions. The term special district governments as defined by the U.S. Census Bureau excludes school districts. In 2007, the U.S. had more than 37,000 special district governments. <laughs> <laughs> Definition of special district by the United States Census The United States Census counts government units across all states. This includes special districts. To count the special districts the census must define the special districts so as to address all such governmental entities across the broad spectrum of 50 states definitions and interpretations. The census's full definition is, special district governments are independent, special purpose governmental units, other than school district governments, that exist as separate entities with substantial administrative and fiscal independence from general purpose local governments. As defined for Census Bureau statistics on governments, the term special district governments excludes school district governments as they are defined as a separate governmental type. Special district governments provide specific services that are not being supplied by existing general purpose governments. Most perform a single function, but in some instances, their enabling legislation allows them to provide several, usually related, types of services. The services provided by these districts range from such basic social needs as hospitals and fire protection, to the less conspicuous tasks of mosquito abatement and upkeep of cemeteries. The Census Bureau classification of special district governments covers a wide variety of entities, most of which are officially called districts or authorities. Not all public agencies so termed, however, represent separate governments. Many entities that carry the designation district or authority are, by law, so closely related to county, municipal, town or township, or state governments that they are classified as subordinate agencies of those governments in Census Bureau statistics on governments, and are not counted as separate special district governments. In order to be classified as a special district government, rather than as a subordinate agency, an entity must possess three attributes existence as an organized entity, governmental character, and substantial autonomy. Each state description also lists various statutory authorities, commissions, corporations, and other forms of organizations that have certain governmental characteristics, but are subject by law to administrative or fiscal control by the state or by independent local governments, therefore, they are classified as subordinate agencies of those governments. Characteristics Special districts serve limited areas and have governing boards that accomplish legislatively assigned functions using public funds. Areas served Special districts provide specialized services to persons living within the designated geographic area and may contract to provide services outside the area. Special districts often cross the lines of towns, villages, and hamlets but less frequently cross city or county lines. Increasingly, however, regional special districts are being created that may serve a large portion of a state or portions of more than one state. Topic. Governing body Each district is governed by a board of directors, commissioners, board of supervisors, or the like. These boards may be appointed by public officials, appointed by private entities, popularly elected, or elected by benefited citizens typically, property owners. Sometimes, one or more public officials will serve as an ex officio member on the board. The board of a special district serves primarily as a managing board and often appoints a chief executive for day-to-day -day operations and decision-making and policy implementation. In the New England states, special districts are often run in the same town meeting fashion as other local governments. Most districts have employees, but some districts exist solely to raise funds by issuing bonds and or by providing tax increment financing.
Topic: Functions. Special districts perform many functions including airports, ports, highways, mass transit, parking facilities, fire protection, libraries, parks, cemeteries, hospitals, irrigation, conservation, sewerage, wastewater treatment, solid waste, fiber optic systems, stadiums, water supply, electric power, and natural gas utility. Legal basis. Originated from English custom, special districts are authorized by state law and must have public foundation, civil office, and public accountability. English custom Special districts in the United States follow the English custom. The earliest known general law in England authorizing special purpose authorities was the Statute of Sewers of 1532. Single-purpose authorities created by individual charters also existed at the time. However, the early authorities were temporary and unconnected to local government structure. The first laws authorizing permanent authorities connected to local governments were the incorporated guardians of the poor, which were created by special acts in the 17th century. Turnpike trusts were an early and popular special-purpose authority in England. Internal drainage boards are current examples in parts of England and Wales. Topic: <inaudible> State law. Special districts in the United States are founded by some level of government in accordance with state law, either constitutional amendment, general law, or special acts and exist in all states. Special districts are legally separate entities with at least some corporate powers. Districts are created by legislative action, court action, or public referendum. The procedures for creating a special district may include procedures such as petitions, hearings, voter or landowner approval, or government approval. Tribal governments may create special districts pursuant to state law and may serve on the boards of special districts. <laughs> public foundation. Special districts, like all public entities, have public foundation. The landmark case of the U.S. Supreme Court addressing public versus private charters was Dartmouth College v. Woodward in 1819. Dartmouth established the fundamental differences between public and private organizations. Critically, a government must be founded by all of the people of a governmental area or by their governmental representatives. Civil office Special districts possess some form of civil office, that is, the board has received a delegation of sovereign power from the state. Some boards may be appointed by only landowners. Private entities may appoint some or all of the members of a special district, however, there must be evidence of civil office. In addition to special districts with privately appointed boards, a special district may have a privately founded board, however, such a board could not be given the power to set a tax. <laughs> <laughs> Accountability There is a citizen-government fiscal accountability relationship. To maintain accountability for special districts, states must maintain ultimate control the power to repeal the authorizing law at any time. Due to public foundation and, thus, ultimate control, the state can freely delegate sovereign power such as the power to tax to special districts and can allow them to act autonomously with little supervision. History There is little information available on the earliest special districts in the United States. It is known that park districts existed in the 18th century. Toll road and canal corporations existed in the 19th century. The first general statute authorizing irrigation districts was adopted by California in 1887. The U.S. Census Bureau began identifying and collecting data on special districts in 1942. Trends The state of Illinois leads the nation in the number of special districts with California close behind. 
State counts of their special districts may differ from the federal count because the states may have different definitions of a special district than the U.S. Census Bureau. Examples All of the following examples have been found by the U.S. Census Bureau to be special districts. See the Census of Governments Government Organization Publications at a Depository Library or visit https colon slash slash www.census.gov and select Governments Division. Alabama, Alabama Municipal Electric Authority Special Act Alaska, Regional Electrical Authorities General Law Arizona, Drainage Districts General Law Arkansas, Fire Ant Abatement Districts General Law California, Golden Gate Bridge, Highway and Transportation District Colorado, Ambulance Districts General Law Connecticut, Pomparag Valley Water Authority Special Act Delaware, Tax Ditches General Law Florida, Daytona Beach Racing and Recreational Facilities District Special Act, Reedy Creek Improvement District, which includes the Walt Disney Resort and the cities of Bay Lake and Lake Buena Vista Special Act, the Tohopecaliga Water Authority TWA, or TOHO for short, which provides the majority of the public water, wastewater, and reclaimed water services for Osceola County and some small parts of Polk and Orange Counties Special Act Georgia, Airport Authorities Special Acts Hawaii, Office of Hawaiian Affairs Constitutional Amendment Idaho, Auditorium Districts General Law Illinois, Chicago Transit Authority Special Act Indiana, Northwest Indiana Regional Development Authority Special Act Iowa, Library Districts Joint or Regional General Law Kansas, Industrial Districts General Law Kentucky, Louisville Jefferson County Air Pollution Control District General Law with Special Application Louisiana, Abbeville Film and Visitors Commission District Special Act Maine, Cemetery Districts Special Acts Maryland, Water and Sewer Authorities General Law Massachusetts, Goose Pond Maintenance District Special Act Michigan, Recreation Authorities General Law Minnesota Metropolitan Mosquito Control District Special Act Mississippi Lighting Districts Special Acts Missouri Jackson County Sports Complex Authority Special Act Montana County Rail Authorities General Law Nebraska Omaha Metropolitan Utilities District General Law with Special Application New Hampshire Housing Authorities General Law New Jersey, Port Authority of New York and New Jersey and New Jersey Turnpike Authority 1948 Law Joint or Regional General Law New Mexico, Cotton Bowl Weevil Control Districts General Law New York, Hyde Park Fire and Water District Special Act North Carolina, Research Triangle Regional Public Transit Authority Special Act North Dakota, Vector Control Districts General Law Ohio, New Community Authorities, Special Improvement Districts, Transportation Improvement Districts General Law Oklahoma, Public Library Systems General Law Oregon, Geothermal Heating Districts, Port Authorities-1909 General Law Pennsylvania, Philadelphia Regional Port Authority Special Act Rhode Island, East Providence Special Development District Commission Special Act South Carolina, Myrtle Beach Air Base Redevelopment Authority Executive Order South Dakota, Television Translator Districts General Law Tennessee, Utility Districts General Law Texas, Palacios Seawall Commission Special Act Utah, Irrigation Districts General Law Vermont, Vermont Public Power Supply Authority Special Act Virginia, Buchanan County Tourist Train Development Authority Special Act Washington, Hydroelectric Resources Authorities General Law West Virginia, Hatfield-McCoy Regional Recreation Authority Special Act Wisconsin, Local Professional Baseball Park Districts General Law Wyoming, Resort Districts General Law See also District FOCJ Joint Powers Authority 
Local government in the United States Public Benefit Corporation Special Districts in Illinois